Hello friends, Running Kimono, and I wanted to make this special video just about um, toilet paper because I think that this is one item that a lot of us, you know, after the last three years or something, we still want to stock up on. So this specific video is curbside only. Do not do this in store. You're going to order this through your cell phone or desktop computer, drive to the store and pick it up. And that is called a curbside pickup and you are hitting that blue button on the left hand side and hopefully your store has everything in stock. And if I could ask for one huge favor, guys, if you could please take a second and like this video, I would be so, 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 so grateful. Thank you guys. So we are going to be grabbing um, a mix and match or whichever you want of the Walgreens four count ultra soft. They are priced this week for a dollar 99. So for the first scenario, we're going to add seven to a basket and you can pick to answer one quick question. Is this anything like Sherman to give you one quick answer? Yes, it is. Uh, my husband really likes it, believe it or not. So um, definitely an item that we stock up on. And the rolls are rather thick as well. That's, they're not being dishonest with their toilet paper math when they say that's 17 rolls. It's uh, some pretty meaty rolls. Okay, so deal number one. Again, this is curbside. So uh, we are going to grab seven, seven of these uh, for $1.99 for a price of $13.93. Now, why is it that the general public isn't clearing out the store for these uh, four packs of this? I think that most part people want like, you know, they want Charmin or Quilted Northern or Cottonelle. So this is our little secret, wink, wink. In the coupon box where coupon codes type in WAG20 to save an extra 20%. There was another code that was stacking on certain items. I think it's Earth20. Could not get it to work, but this one is working. Looking at the overall basket for our seven gorgeous rolls, it's $13.93. $2.80 coming off for WAG's WAG20, not WAG's, but WAG20. Free curbside pickup, a little bit of tax, and our new total is $11.80 for the seven um, toilet papers. I think this is a very smart deal. Okay, so for deal number two, we're just going to kind of change the basket around a little bit. Walgreens also has this generic single roll <laughs> for 79 cents. I sometimes throw them into my little like, you know, get all this stuff for cheap uh, curbside pickup. Throw in one of those and then we're just going to change the basket around where we're going to grab six of those um, Walgreens super premium toilet papers for $1.99. So it's going to kind of skew the math, but you're going to see the method here to this madness. So the overall subtotal is um, $12.73 with WAG 20, $2.40 is coming off. We have free curbside pickup, a little bit of tax. The new total is $10.95, $10 subtracting, subtracting the tax and just looking at the overall basket because tax is different in every state. It shakes out all the toilet paper if you itemize each item to um, $1.47 per for those packs. Very good deal. And to get the smallest out of pocket for both deals, if you wish to use a little bit of Walgreens cash, go for it. You got to spend it sometime. So I would absolutely use like $10 in Walgreens cash and call this a super brilliant deal. Okay, last thing I want to touch on is I made a YouTube short yesterday um, about some Easter clearance. And my understanding is that some stores might have manually put it through at 80%. Others, I haven't seen that it went 80%. So I don't know if this one store is 80%. And I really don't want to go back today. But um, a manager was telling me some stuff yesterday. Um, in the past, she's refused to scan my register rewards, given me a difficult time. Just the gamut of things. And there's always a lot of sighing. It's um, very frustrating because I'm not a very confrontational person, but somebody's going to act that way and sigh and just roll their eyes. It's not a very comfortable time at Walgreens. And I know a lot of you go through that, but it's just one manager who doesn't like me. The rest of the managers, super lovely besties. They're so nice, but this one lady does not like me. And it just happens in life. She followed me around to the... Um, <laughs> toy aisle she followed me to the toilet paper aisle and she didn't see that it was tagged at her own store and this was like two o'clock in the afternoon and there was probably 30 on this display i grabbed four for my mother-in-law she has a couple fur babies and you know i thought this would be helpful use a bit of walgreens cash a no-brainer and from the corner of my eye when i was checking out because i had the kids toys and a, a couple other things um she had cleared the entire shelf i think for staff and stuff she brought it all to the back for her family whatever and I never, like, it's not my place to question or anything like that. But um, 
if you guys are wondering why it might be in stock, but it's not showing, possibly that could be happening. They can't check out till their shift is over, but it's interesting. And I'm just going to point that out. Um, but yeah, and I don't know why uh, th this lady and I don't get along. Um, I'm friendly enough, uh, but I'm not a confrontational person. So when I do see her, I just kind of like pivot. I just get out of there because I don't want any trouble. If you want to try and see if your store has it, this is paper towel. You have to do this in store only, but you can see through the app, if it's actually in stock, you are going to type in Walgreens Super Premium Ultra Quilted Paper Towels for count. And if it shows that blue box in stock, definitely go to your store and get a price check. And if it's a buck 59, that's called rock and roll stock up time, guys. If not, you know, uh, maybe either on a Tuesday or a Saturday, it will get marked down more. You never know. That's usually the day that they roll out those orange tags. But I know some states it hasn't yet. I know that I have a friend in like, I think Idaho, and it's not for his store yet. But hopefully, fingers crossed soon. That is it for this video, guys. As always, uh, thanks for watching and good luck with all these paper deals. We'll catch you in the next one. Bye.